clothes were finished yesterday. Um, Don and I and John the Beaver. What's the gentleman's name? From Brian Emery. Thank you. Brian Emery finished them up. During the whole process, <coughs> um, we had to deal with um, standard and fours. Whitley County is now um, bumped up from an A rating to an A plus rating, which helped tremendously with our interest rates. We as a county will save to finish out the payment on this building $414,000. So over the next 20, 20. That's, that's net savings after paying expenses of refinance? Yes, sir. The refinances were right in the on the line, so that's yeah, net savings. Well, I think this, this extends it a little bit. Nope. It does not. Same number of years. Finished the same time. When is, when is the payoff? Do you know? What year? 2024, I'm pretty sure. I didn't bring that with me. I thought it was 2023. Could be 2024. I think it's the taxes are collected <coughs> in 2023, and then we make that last payment in February it could of 2024. Be. So it'll be done. It'll be here before we know it. We may not. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> I might be. <laughs> well, that's, that's a neat deal. Save us some money. Yeah, very much. Mm -hmm. Great. It's about a whole year's payment. Yeah. So we take almost a year. Uh, we were also passed out a uh, letter to our council members from the uh, county assessor. Uh, requesting an increasing of uh, Kim Erdley's salary. And everybody has a chance to look through this. I don't know that we can really do anything until they've had this election and we get a new assessor. Can they even know well, this much? I think the only reason Rita came back to you was because she feels that the person in her office is doing her old job as chief deputy with her experience and her certification. You bumped Rita. I gave her the one time thing of 750. 750. 750. And she, in a two person office, it was like you were condoning her for being doing her job when the other person came in doing just as good. It kind of saved Rita time and effort and training with the background. And I do, I don't know what's going to come of the caucus. Matt hasn't got back with anyone. He's about run out of time. No. Oh, no, she's resigning, what, July? Yeah, July, July 7th. Yeah. So yeah. July. Yeah, you can't do nothing until her, yeah. Yeah. After her final day. Um, Matt and Jim Banks was in, and he could have the caucus any time, but he's oh. been working on the delegates down. No. Oh, yeah. Oh. The, the South new delegate this week. and the vice chair. Oh, yes. Yeah. So he was busy this last couple of weeks. So I have a feeling when he comes back, they can have the caucus any time now. Okay. And it just has to give 10 days notice. Then she, who, she or he, whoever takes office, will take it effective July 7th. If they don't have their level three at that time, they cannot be sworn in until the level three is completed, and that will be mid-August. And that's how it's going to be. If it's Rita. If it's Rita. If there's someone else out there at the level two working for their level three, then it will be that way for it. No, yeah, if, if we waited until after uh, uh, Rita or whoever mm -hmm. is elected, then can we go back uh, retroactively and, and pay uh, Angie standard. back, you know, catch her up? I mean, uh, give her um, a big check to catch her up? You could do that. Well, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but I just think it would be more proper to wait till we who's going to shake it I out. think it, that, that's I agree with that. Then that yeah. way you know who's going to be in what positions because it's going to be a permanent type thing. Yeah. And then if she's going to be the deputy, and we can, if she's been doing this job, we can go back, whatever, two or three months or whatever we want to do and <coughs> she'll pay her up, I think. I don't, I don't disagree with you one bit. The only thing, I, I'm a little, if she's doing the Chief Jeffrey's work, I hate for her to get aggravated and quit because... Well, I mean, I think we could tell Rita that that's our plan, and we just think it's to make it more up appropriate after the to do it that right. way. Right. Well, I don't have a problem with that. Okay. And at that time, we change your salary? Well, I think, you know, do it, right. do it everything the way it's supposed to going to be yeah. permanently from that yeah. on. And I say, we can go back and pick up her pay and, and just tell Rita that that's our plan, what our plan is, and that we, I just feel like it's a, 
the proper right. way to do that. Well, you never know. Some other eligible person may come out of the woodwork. And, and the we can wait to go back and pay her if she's done it's the work. I mean, sure. charge. We can compensate her retroactive for the work she's done. Yeah. I think Yesterday there was some discussion. I, I was talking to Rita there was about, about this caucus, and there's some discussion that it could be done yet this month. And I mm -hmm. said, wait. I said, couldn't Angie rescind her resignation any time prior to the effective date? Mm -hmm. So why would you have a caucus Until the day. knowing that she might be, she could come back? Spend your wheels in the mud. It, it, doesn't make, it didn't make sense to me. The caucus ought to be very soon after that, but I just don't understand how you could have a caucus. I mean, you they can have schedule one, one, Don, for any time after the 7th. Yeah, yeah but they were too. talking about this month, and I, and I just thought, well, what kind of mess would that be? Well, I think it'd be, I think it might be good if they would uh, schedule something, and, you know, they well, it should be scheduled. Then they always, do. Uh, I don't think they could actually have a caucus and pick a replacement until she's still on. Uh, well, see, that, see that. that is really what makes sense to me. I, I can't well, I imagine having a caucus. Have a caucus you know, yeah, I, I can't. I can't fathom having it before the resignation date takes place. Debbie Beer says it, it has to be ten days within yeah, the ten days notice. Okay. Yeah, ten days notice. Well, I think you can notice. But if if can you have the conversation with Rita and tell her what anticipation is? Uh, uh, or you, you and John, or somebody. I'll yeah. John can do it as long as you get yeah. your, you know, the, right. the that legally, way it or, out. you know, we really can't, but what the plans are. Basically, what we're going to do is table it until next month and then uh, do a review and possibly compensate or retroactive. Exactly. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, I, I guess, guess we will. I, I guess you can't 100% promise. Say we will be doing it. We will be doing it. We'll be taking a look yeah. at it. Because we're going to compensate her for Right, this period of time. Yeah. Make the things shake out with the caucus. Yeah. Okay. Are you taking care of that? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. We might need four of That's why John makes it. <laughs> After you make it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> After signed 300 times. <laughs> uh, in our packet, we also have.